Today I am going to continue my series on reviewing milk. Well, good coffee deserves better milk. So I always say that if you have great coffee, it can be ruined by bad milk. And if you have ordinary or regular coffee, you can upgrade it by using good milk. So milk is very important to making delicious coffee drinks. Not everyone will go for Americano or black coffee. So yes, you have to be very careful about selecting your milk. We are going to review Milk Lab. Now this is available in the Philippines, available in Thailand, this is from Australia and I have here a list of what this milk is all about. It says it is Australia's number one food service alternative milk. It is baristas and consumers that love this milk and we are going to find out how good it really is. So what does Milk Lab boast of? Let's take a look. First, it complements the flavor of espresso coffee. We are going to find out. Second, it offers a rich and creamy mouth feel. Third, it textures and stretches like regular dairy milk to produce the perfect pour. I will try. Fourth, it is versatile for both hot and cold beverages. And that's exactly what we're going to make today. We're going to make a hot latte and also we're going to make iced latte. The price of Milk Lab in Thailand and in the Philippines is slightly more on the expensive side, more premium. But that's exactly what we're going to find out today. Is it worth using this milk for your coffee shops or even for home? Aside from this, Milk Lab is also free from artificial colors, free from artificial preservatives, free from artificial flavors, and it is 100% Australian dairy milk. For the drink today, I'm going to use Philippine coffee, and this is 100% Arabica from Mount Apo, and it is single origin, medium rose with taste notes of caramel, citrus, sweet chocolate. Well, I am looking forward to tasting that with my Milk Lab milk. Okay, let's start by making our hot latte. Wow, my perfect coffee beans definitely <laughs> complemented by this beautifully textured milk and um, it really has a very good mouthfeel I must say. Well, no wonder it is loved by baristas all over the world. Now let's see how it works or how it performs with iced coffee. Beautiful double shot of espresso here for my iced coffee. Now we are going to add Milk Lab milk into this drink. This time I'm not going to add any sweetener, no milk syrup, no syrup, and I'm just going to use purely Milk Lab. Okay, so I'm going to bring it up to 180 milliliters or six ounces, and it looks really, really dark there. If you'd like to make this into vanilla latte, just add a little bit of vanilla. If you'd like to make this um, hazelnut macchiato or caramel macchiato, you can also add caramel. But this time we just want to taste the milk. Okay, so here is my cup full of ice. And we are going to pour this over. And it is perfect. This is a 16 ounce cup. So double shot of espresso and half a cup or 120 ml of milk blood. Okay, now it's time for the moment of truth. I am going to give this a try. I think it is very, very good. 
the texture is creamy, the mouthfeel is there, definitely a deliciously tasting iced latte here, combining both Milk Club and my espresso. So I would say, yeah, I mean, baristas out there, no wonder they are using this milk as their choice for their milky coffee. Well, I must say that uh, it really performed very well in texturing the milk for the latte and then the pour was also easier and for the iced latte the combination of the espresso and just the milk is good enough for everyone. There is no need to add any more flavor especially if, if for those that do not like any sweetener in their drinks. This is just perfect. It is creamy. It's got that um, delicious mouthfeel. In summary, I would say that if you are looking to upgrade your milky drinks and also if you have access to this milk, I would say give this milk a try. Don't forget to check out my books, All Things Milk Tea and The Basic Barista. In the meantime, stay safe, stay tuned. Thank you for watching. Ciao for now.